Hello guys, my name is Forbes and um, welcome to the Great African Channel. So today we are out here at Sandy's River or Colchester, some 50 kilometers outside of PE. We're here to hang out with family, just have a chill day and have fun. So what we are asking for is uh, for you guys to subscribe to our channel, the Great African Channel, like and share our videos, please, as we are desperately trying to grow our channel. So why don't you guys tag along and uh, be a part of uh, our exploring team. So yeah, we out with my boy Ki <laughs> at the Sunday's River. And yeah, we, we, we out to just have fun as family. Not just my boy, but the whole family. Uh, we out to just have adventures and fun. Explore our, our beautiful Eastern Cape. Share the bay, guys. Share the bay. So guys, welcome back to the channel, the Great African channel. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. So uh, we're now at our first spot as we're going down all the way to sea. We we are at the first spot where you can have picnic, you can have rice, and you can fish and swim. What we have for you here? Guys, this is Sandy's River in Colchester, Port Elizabeth, Eastern Cape, South Africa. We've got everything amazing down here. Come down to the coast, come down to Eastern Cape, enjoy the beauty of nature, undisturbed nature, untamed Africa. So guys, we are done with the first stop. We are on our way to the second place. I'll be informing you as we go along. Thanks. So guys, uh, we are now at the sleepway, 
the place is full of mud. Take along and see. That direction is the direction where we came from. Colchester, Sunday's River main entrance and all that. So the river flows from that side, which is inland, coming out this way, going out to the Indian Ocean, out to sea. Here once again, welcome back to the Great uh, African Channel. So now we are going to be doing a trail walk, or rather a walk along Sanders River, all the way to those sand dunes on the horizon there, and all the way out to sea. So take along, join us, and uh, let's enjoy uh, our beautiful views. It's people looking for worms. Fishing worms in the mud on the riverbank. And, uh, I'm not sure what it's called that you use to to take out the sand from from the riverbank and then search for your uh, for your fishing worms in there. So what we're doing is basically sucking them out of the holes, and that's our bait that we use for fish. Yeah, but, oh my goodness. Big one. I'm scared. No, we can. <laughs> I get a big one for you. Is it? So these prawns, you actually get them from the river. Yes. yes. So they're in the mud. It's not the ones that you want to eat. Yeah. Okay. Wow. Yeah, that's okay, the way that we it's the best time to try and pump for them. Is it? Yeah. I, I thought you guys were busy pumping for worms, fishing worms, or something. Sometimes, Sometimes we do. Worms. Yeah. Is it? But if we do get it at the end, we have to. Okay. So guys, these are mud prawns, fresh from the river sand. So prawns survive in water or they survive even in mud as well? They just, they just... Yeah. yeah? Is it? Yeah. So they're saying all these holes in the sand are prawns. Do you fry them? Oh no, we use them to actually get the fish. Is it? Yes. These are not for eating, nothing. No. Oh my word, I'm already it's drilling, picking it. <laughs> <laughs> it's just what we use to actually get the actual fish. Fish, yeah. okay. Yeah. Alright, wow. Thanks guys. Cheers, enjoy your day. So guys, just a quick one. I didn't know that you can find prongs in the sand or rather in the mud along the banks of the river and uh, you know, the prawns look fresh and all that but apparently they're telling us that those prawns are been so apparently uh, they use these prawns for fishing uh, I wouldn't use them for fishing myself I would definitely definitely <laughs> eat them I'll just fry them however way I'll just give it a try come up with a recipe do my Mozambican prawns and that's it I can't use them for fishing why why should I waste for those who are much more privileged like than I am uh, they have money they bring their boats and they spend the day cruising in their boats going up and down the river not too sure if this open boat can go out to sea but be sure to enjoy this one definitely definitely enjoy the sunday's river guys this fish is called a gannet it looks flat it looks like a shark though is it is it but it looks like a shark though Guys, this fish is called a gannet. They say it's very nice to eat. Okay, so this is the last spot where you guys leave your cars 
before you go out uh, to the river mouth. The river mouth is uh, that direction. Hi guys, welcome back. So, uh, this is Colchester, that's where we started from. And then we drove inside uh, the park. And then we were here by Hoodie, Hoodie Cap. And then these are the banks, Sunday, Sunday's river banks, going down all the way to Hoodie Heart, Hoodie Cap office, the Cap Padron, and all the way out to sea. So, apparently, uh, this is the border. This is the border between Colchester and Ado. So this side is Colchester. Behind this board or behind that fence is Ado. So uh, here I am. I'm not going to go through the gate. I'm actually going to uh, jump the border into Ado. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> Welcome to Ado. <laughs> Guys, this is Ado. Even the air here is fresh. It's super fresh. You enjoy it. It's amazing. Can you feel it from there? Can you feel the breeze hitting the skin? It's amazing, guys. Oh my word. Just look at all that. Enjoy the scene. I want to go up there, up that dune and join my family. Guys, the most difficult part comes again. The part where I hate going up. The dunes, the part that requires energy and all that. Oh my word. It reminds me of Sissy Kama. When we were going to the river mouth, it's crazy. Finally, I did it. I'm on top of the dune. Yo, but it's exhausting, man. It's crazy. Sunday's river, the mouth and the Indian Ocean. This is where they live. Sunday's river going back inland. Sunday's river coming to meet the ocean and going out at sea. This is beautiful guys.
Yeah? You know that I was swimming. I saw you swimming. Huh? I saw you swimming. <laughs> Are you guys enjoying fishing? Pretty much. Any luck yet? Two so far. Ah, awesome. I think I like his way of fishing. Though. <laughs> that is awesome, eh? Welcome back. So uh, we are done with our walk at the river mouth. We are done with uh, sand dunes, climbing and all that. So now we have settled here just to have a quick, uh, some obviously drinks and, and food. And uh, from then on we, we go home. So this is it. 